Hi, I'm Lorraine from Connolly's Red Mills. Today we're going to talk about respiratory health. Did you know the adult horse takes about 12 breaths per minute, exchanging five liters of air with each breath? This increases massively during exercise due to the increased demand for oxygen. At high intensities, a horse will take up to 120 breaths per minute, exchanging 15 liters of air with each breath. It is therefore no surprise that any disruption to the respiratory system, resulting in reduced oxygen intake, will have major implications on the performance of athletic horses. There are several possible reasons for poor performance linking to the respiratory system. In this video, we aim to highlight the most common problems and the environmental changes which can be made to reduce the risks. Poor respiratory health may be caused by physical conditions in the pharynx and the larynx, which restrict the amount of air entering the lungs. These anatomical dysfunctions, such as roaring or gurgling, should be diagnosed by your vet, as they may require surgery to resolve. Exercise-induced pulmonary hemorrhage, also known as bleeding, is a common and concerning condition which causes bleeding in the lungs during intense bouts of exercise. The cause is likely a result of increased blood vessel pressure in the lungs and a failure of the gas barrier membrane. Apart from intense exercise, no other risk factors have been identified. Horses can be prescribed Lasix to control bleeding during training, but the use of Lasix during competition is not legal in Europe. Suspected lung infections should be diagnosed and treated by your vet. Bacterial and viral infections are more common in younger horses and include equine herpes virus, equine influenza and strangles. These are highly contagious and notifiable diseases. Recurrent airway obstruction and inflammatory airway disease are two chronic and performance limiting conditions which fall under the equine asthma umbrella. Recurrent airway obstruction, previously known as heaves, is a respiratory inflammation affecting horses usually nine years and older. Symptoms include chronic coughing, wheezing, and labored breathing even at rest. Inflammatory airway disease commonly affects younger performance horses as a result of inhaled environmental irritants. Symptoms include occasional coughing, mucus buildup, and reduced performance. Both conditions can be exacerbated by your horse's environment and are often worse when your horse is stabled. Irritants include ammonia, molds and fungus from hay and bedding, dust from hay, bedding and riding surfaces, and dander and hair from other horses. Management changes can greatly improve the symptoms of equine asthma. 24-7 turnout is ideal, but where this isn't possible, turn out as much as you can and use dust-free bedding such as shredded paper. Steam or soak your forage and always feed from the ground. Test your forage regularly to ensure it's free from moulds and fungus. Water your riding surfaces. Ensure your stables are well ventilated and muck out on a daily basis. Supplements which reduce inflammation and promote immune function may be useful to horses suffering with respiratory problems. Foreign Equine's Kentucky Caron Oil is rich in omega-3 fatty acids which have natural anti-inflammatory properties. Another supplement which may be useful is Foreign Equine's Air Vent Syrup and Gel. This is recommended for use prior to exercise to support, soothe and open airways. If you have any questions about this video or would like more information on our feed and supplement ranges, get in touch with one of our nutritionists today. If you found this video useful, please like, comment and share with your friends. Thank you for watching.